Hello, hello, hello. You're tuning in to the episode of The Wonder Can Show. Today's second topic, bro, bro, the, wire, uh, the, the Baltimore Ravens add or are about to add another wide receiver. Oh. <laughs> bro, once again, when I am right, I Oh! And how many of y'all still trying to disagree with me? Bro, yo, yo. Oh. So if y'all have not heard, <laughs> bro, check this out. Sources, sources have come out and said that <laughs> the Ravens are expected to sign veteran wide receiver Anthony Miller. The 29-year-old spent last season with the Chiefs and has 12 career touchdowns. I, when I say this, I think I speak for all, or at least 99.9% of Baltimore Raven fans. And I truly do believe when I say this, I'm speaking for the bulk of us. Who? Who? Who is this man? Who are you? Who are you? Y'all heard of Anthony Miller? Listen. Let me tell you how nasty this is. Nasty work. Let me tell you how nasty work this is, right? <laughs> so, from 2018 to 2020, he played in the Chicago Bears. 2021, he played for the Houston Texans. 2021 to 2022, he played for uh, the Steelers. Then 2023, he played for 49ers. And that same year, he played for the uh, the Indianapolis Colts. And the year after, he played for the Kansas City Chiefs. You know what's funny about all that? Here, this is why I'm going to make you laugh. From tw after 2020, right? He's played, uh, 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 I'm talking about from after 2020, I mean 2021 and now. He has played a total of three games. Three. Six receptions. 25 yards. Ooh. How, how does Blade do it? Ooh. Uh, feel wonderful. Oh. <laughs> Yo, check this out. And all together, he has what? 12 touchdowns. He had seven touchdowns his rookie year, two was after that, two after that, one, and then zero. He was on the squads, but it looks totally as a practice player. Do you know what this says? Once again, just like the people that tried to champion Benjamin Cleveland against me. I know some of y'all are still mad about that, right? Yeah, I told you, listen, I'll wait. I'm one of those, I'll wait to be correct. I'll sit back like this. Go on. Uh-huh, uh-huh. And once I'm right, I come with the five-finger salute. No! Oh! Jeez! Oh! So, this is what this says. I just want y'all to understand this. Because some of y'all can't see beyond the trees. Right? So, let me explain it to you. This means one of two things. It means they're getting another person to light a fire under the wide receivers that are unper underperforming in training camp. You know, the guys that I've been telling y'all be getting locked down for the most of camp. Or, this is a big or, Bateman's injury is worse than they're trying to let on. And he didn't practice, I think it was today, either, if I'm not mistaken. <laughs> so, yeah, it hurts. Listen, I, I'm somebody that likes the truth, right? I, I really do. Matter of fact, I'm going to double down just to make sure, because I'm pretty sure they said he didn't practice, and uh, Harbaugh had to answer questions about it. Uh <laughs> Oh my God! Let me make sure we check. Uh, 
Yeah, he did not practice. So, <laughs> so like I said, he he's not practicing. <laughs> I th I wanted to make sure you know I don't want to lie to you guys. And even if I think it is, I'm gonna double down. So you have a player that's not practicing. He supposedly made the play of the game. He's been awfully injured most of his career. And y'all tell me that I shouldn't be tripping. Y'all tell me I'm looking into things too much. Y'all tell me that I'm over-exaggerating on these things. Y'all tell me that it, he's the next thing coming uh, of peanut butter and jelly. Look, I told y'all before, I think he has the talent, but the best ability, you know what's coming next, is availability. And if you cannot be available, you are not it. So, okay, so then we're going to have to just lean on, like I said before, the likely thing. So the other episode when I said I think likely he's going to have a crazy year this year because if Bateman does not show up, show out, or he's injured again, I think they're just going to rely heavily on likely to be that other big body receiver and kind of split him out wide. Yeah, I think that's coming to fruition faster than we ever thought. How are you injured this early? I heard so many excuses of why he wasn't down in Miami training with Lamar. You know what my you know what my argument? I said, what happens if he gets hurt in in um in, in, in training camp and, they, and then they don't get the practice during training camp? What are you gonna say? That's not gonna happen, Nitro. They got better things and better people and better trainers. That's what y'all said to me. Now we got Anthony Miller. Oh, I know some of y'all gonna be drinking the Kool-Aid on this one. Oh, they got him because he's a dog. They got him because he can he can turn out to be Rand, Randy Moss, Jerry Rice, Terrell Owens, Calvin Johnson, Andre Johnson, Tariq Hill, Devontae Adams, Cooper Cop. Like, bro, stop! This man, this man hasn't played in a game in like three seasons. He wasn't good enough to make any of the teams. They said the last team he was on the Kansas City Chiefs. The man never saw the field. Never saw the field. And they had wide receiver problems. He didn't. The man came like, he didn't see the field. He saw Stevie Wonder. Looking back on Baina. Was a little nappy headed boy. He couldn't see. And y'all be like, I be tripping, bro. Yo, listen, man, I, I'm going to be real with you. If this injury holds Bateman out, I do not want to hear no more excuses. This is the last year. I, I Listen, I listen. I, I'm, I'm done. If this year he's injured and awfully injured, I don't want to hear, oh, next year will be the year of Nitro. I swear to God, if y'all do, y'all be getting white hand side and black hand side. Hand would just turn red, like straight up. You have to come see me. Like, because this is ridiculous. And look, nobody plans for injuries. But at the same time, we've been putting all the eggs in the Bateman basket. And I keep hearing excuses. That's why we don't get the veterans. That's why we don't get all um, stars. We got to give Bateman his touches. We got to give Bateman his chances. We got to give Bateman our faith. We got to give Bateman our souls. We got to give Bateman our money. We got to give Bateman our years. Gotta waste Lamar's years. Like, when is it enough? How many more years do y'all want? I'm telling y'all, bro, if this man is if injured this year, I don't want you see next year. You think I'm bad now? The monster that you will see. The absolute monster, the fangs, the teeth, the bloodlust. You will see him next season during the offseason. Blame it every chance I get. Because there'll be no excuse. What would EDC be able to say then? Oh, yeah, yeah this will be the year for him. Year six? Huh? Year five? Huh? I'm just saying, man, I'm tired of this foolishness, bro. I really am. And I hope the uh, hopefully y'all are tired of it too. Because at what point is enough enough? Like, Jesus, man. But what do you guys think? Do you think? He's there as a camp body to light a fire under the poor performing wide receivers that we've had at camp so far? Or do you think that he's there because the Bateman injury is worse than they're letting on? 
Let me know which one you think it is at the bottom of the screen and inside the comment section, all right? But as always, this episode of the Wonderkind show. Thank you for watching. Y'all know how we get down. We have fun and we laugh. But everything we talk about is rooted in what? Facts and truth. Please do remember, like, subscribe, hit that notification bell, and leave a comment. You don't love the comments. Guys, we're going for 10 thousand subscribers please do tell some people about the wonderkin show let's get this thing built properly and built out and let's get everybody on this train we're trying to build this thing the right way the right way straight up and um if you have not checked out already the wonderkin show's patreon check it out three tiers of content goodness waiting for your son to give it a look give it a try let me know what you think and if you'd like to donate to the channel help out with the equipment and such stuff like that right now uh we're trying to get a starlink we need about 80 more dollars Bottom of the screen right here, there's a QR code. QR codes to a cash app. Cash app is located in the description of every video that we do. Name of it is Money Sign, The Wonderkin Show. Super easy. But once again, this is The Wonderkin Show. This is your host, for signing off. And as always, you guys know my slogan. <gasps> Peace. And I am out of here. Huh? Yeah! Finish him, Daddy. Oh, oh, oh. Yeah!